We have been working on my St. Bartholomew costume for Halloween this year, and I wanted to show you our progress so far. Bart is the saint who is skinned alive. I have a weak stomach and an eye for glamour, so those are our guiding lights. This is easily my most ambitious peasant project to date, so I hired the best in the business to help me out, Sister Cecilia. To gather my saint supplies, I had this flayed flesh unitard, a matching red hood, opera length gloves, a cheap mask, breeches, and these wedge boots. Our first costume fitting combined these elements and used a checkered bed sheet as a stand-in for the skin shawl. I had learned from my medieval spider peasant costume that in the future I wanted more flexibility with my costume embellishments and I wanted more of it to be machine washable. So Sister Cecilia sewed a grid of snaps onto this inner layer of flesh and to the gloves as well. I took the other half of the snaps and sewed plastic bingo chips onto them until they looked like this. Then I checked my costume stock for some possible blood embellishments, and I found some good options for the skin shawl as well. But there wasn't enough, so we had to go bead shopping in medieval Manhattan, which was a lot of fun, but also very expensive. And then my favorite part in this journey so far is that Sister Cecilia took the beads and the tassels and made the most beautiful collection of snap-on blood drip bingo snaps I've ever seen. And then we started snapping those blood drops onto St. Bartholomew. With the snap system, you can rearrange the embellishments however you want, and they can all be removed so the base garment stays washable. There is still so much to figure out before All Hallows Eve, especially the skin shawl. And if you would like to help take this snap system worldwide, please consider joining the Greedy Peasant Patreon, because these medieval pageant costumes we're making are only going to get more elaborate.